Hello everyone, my name is Zishan and in this video I will demonstrate how to execute some Java code when the task flow started and when the task flow ended. And we will also see how to open a task flow in a dialog box. For this example, I have created a two task flows. One is called EMP table view edit and DPT. Other one is DPT edit flow and what I'm doing I have a main page which I'm calling for both task flow using task flow activity uh, we can take this is the DPT task flow this first default activity is the list and then we will add it single record and we can say for either cancel the changes and go back to the home site and uh, the same is the EMP one you can see the EMP list edit and save and cancel changes these are the task flow return activities and the outcome you can see I have mentioned a go home for both of these and what this outcome is actually this is the task flow URL call going to the main so go home this outcome is actually called on the these task flow exit to open a uh, the first thing we want to execute some logic when this task flow called so what will happen first we need to create a java class what I, I have created here the two different classes emp task flow and uh, these simple java classes you don't have to implement any interface or uh, so what we uh, after that you will go to the task flow in the overview section under manage pin and define them as a page flow scope name for your bean the class actual class that you have created and the page flow scope and then you have a two properties one is initializer and a finalizers these are you can point to some method initializers means that uh, when the task flow started so call this method and finalizer when the task flow end call the method so what I have done here like I just printing a message to initialize employee task flow is started and other one is this and same I did for the finalizer but different bean and to open this task flow in a dialog box you have to select the task flow activity you are calling from the main page and this is the behavior section choose the run as dialog true and the display type what kind of display type you want and the other thing when you are calling I drag and drop the task flow and as a buttons here and on the button property you have to choose this use window to true and the size of the window so let's see how these things are working uh, I started the app and press the EMP table view and you can see in my logs EMP task flow is started and uh, I can go and edit some some stuff here save save and uh, all points back to the home means the task flow ended and let's go to run the department and this will open in a dialog box you can see same I have a edit button to edit something or I can close this so you can see the in logs windows oops this is strange but you can see the task flow started for department and and it as well appears this is kind of strange I will take a look so yeah I think we have to handle some other method so mean uh, for for this video we have uh, we fulfill the purpose uh, for these initializer and finalizer property so hope you like the video 
and feel free to comment it thanks for watching bye